It seemed like a perfectly quiet and still Sunday morning for most Singaporeans. Or so it seemed. For 70,000 others who gathered across the bay on the 4th of September, this much-anticipated event was the culmination of months of progressive training. This was the Army Half Marathon and Safra Bay Run, which aims to promote a healthy lifestyle and reinforce Safra and the Singapore Armed Forces' emphasis on physical fitness. 21,000 athletes participated in the 21km event that morning, but one individual that ran the race for the third consecutive year caught our attention. My name is Muhammad Sharif Abdullah, and also known as Singapore First Blade Runner. See, I, in 2008, I was amputated 5 inch of my thumb. I nearly gave up my life. But I was very inspired by this guy by the name of Oscar Pitorius. He's the world double amputee. He runs uh, uh, sprinting, you know. So I was telling myself, hey, if he can run, why not me? So I just do a research and I find out that uh, there are no one in, in Asia who runs with, with a running prosthetic leg, you know. So let's make it the first one and show that to, to the whole world that Singapore has to have an amputee like me to run. You know, inspire a lot of people. One month after I got my new blade, I started to run the first uh, half marathon, but after I completed my 21 kilometers, I found that I have a potential in running marathon. So I was telling myself, I will come back for the 2010 Army Half Marathon. So meanwhile, I keep on doing like other races, like even I do ultra marathon before going to a full marathon in December. And I, I did my uh, 50 kilometer ultra during the, the North Face Singapore. Ever since I started running in 2009, we run at East Coast Park. But this time, it's all changed from the starting point right up to the ending point. The fun part is the ending point where we call it the killer hill. You need to go up uphill, you know, and that's really test our endurance. And I salute to everyone who did it. I want to inspire those army boys. I want to show them that I, as an amputee who have not went to army, has run uh, marathons, ultra marathons, they too can do it. As long as they don't give up, focus in themselves, believe in themselves, and say that I too can do it. Today my timing is about 2 hours 40. I feel a bit disappointed. Based on the 2010, uh, timing was about 2, two hours and 25. So I think there's something, uh, maybe the weather is humid. With little time to waste, Sharif was all warmed up for the second race of the day, the 800 meter father and child challenge. My name is Nur Atira. This was the first time both of them had participated in a mass run together. I'm really happy to run with my father. Let me tell you something about our training schedule. Okay, during the fasting month, we, we normally we train, uh, we to wake, wake up early, so we wake up at 3 a.m. So 3 a.m. I will go for my 10 kilometer run. Then when I reach home about about uh, 4 o'clock, I will fetch her, go for a short distance, one kilometer run around the estates. Then uh, we, we start to our breakfast, then she will go to school. Can do it! Yes! And I feel very happy and honoured, you know, to run uh, with, not say with my children, but with other parents too. And it, it's something, a good uh, bonding, family bonding together where the father and the children is. Having completed two races in a day, Sharif and his family had much to celebrate. And so did we. This was indeed a beautiful Sunday for all of us at Cyber Pioneer TV as well. 